Hey, Brad. Okay, Toki Zara time. It, it is an amazing testament to the quality of Seiko that a watch in this condition, unserviced, will run. This, when I see, the, this is the beat error number. It runs from 00, zero which is the best, to 99, nine, which is the worst. But routinely, exclusively, when I see 99, nine, what that means is that the machine is basically saying error. It can't hear correctly. So I don't believe this. Um, I can't believe it's running at 205. I cannot believe it's running at 205. This thing had water inside of it. Um, enough so much that the uh, this is the movement ring rusted to pieces. Uh, we're going to have to find another one of those. That's going to be lots of fun. Uh, the movement's real dirty. I actually kind of wish I hadn't gotten it running because it's it's got so much gruck in here. But I mean, even with that, you can see the shine on the plates. I've seen so much worse. I've seen so much worse. It stops and it resets. Uh, it's definitely funky. The stem is too long. It's had some work in it that isn't right. I don't know. We need to look at the cosmetics. Hang on. Yeah, that's amazing. Those numbers are nuts. I can't believe that it's running at that at that level. That is really, really something. Yeah, I think somebody was inside who didn't really know what they were doing. I think that's the problem. Because the arms are not where they're supposed to be. Yeah, that's exactly right. Yeah, that's exactly right. Yeah, even just that is enough to make things better. I'm just fiddling with the adjustment arms really quick because I don't like I don't like to see things loping just for fun. Just for fun. Sorry, this is a pretty boring video. In any case, yeah, genuine Toki Zaras are uh, you don't see them very often, and uh, it's just it's interesting to see them. Okay, let's, let me stop playing with this. Okay, so the watch is definitely running. Uh, it's, it's resetting mostly correctly. The upper register is not resetting for me correctly. But it's definitely a runner. It's dirty. Most of the case brushing is gone, but the case lines are still there. It's a, this is a working watch. This was your father's watch, wasn't it? Yeah, this was your father's watch, and he wore this thing all the time. This was your father's watch. Amazing testament to the quality of Seiko, that he gets to live such a hard-working life and still do what it needed to do, which is run. Hmm. Well, it's going to need it all. The dial isn't bad, the hands aren't bad. Uh, the case definitely shows wear, but after cleaning, it'll definitely be improved. I don't have the right bracelet for this, but I have other bracelets that are more correct than this. Though, of course, you could certainly leave this. After we're done with it, it'll be much prettier, and it will be reliable. Don't worry. We can we can bring this thing back. The only thing I'm worried about is finding that movement ring. Uh, spring, that's going to be a challenge. But you never know in the world of Seiko what we can find. We'll just dig around and see what we can come up with. Okay. Thank you. Sorry for that strange video. Okay.